Hey guys, Tony the Story Sass Sass and welcome to another episode of Cigar Review. So, today we have a cigar sent in by Roger, the Walking Man Cigar. Right here, this is the Drop Cigar Club Royal Palm Robusto. Okay. <clears throat> so, yeah, he sent this back um, a month ago or something like that. With the whole package thing, go watch the um, unboxing if you don't know what I'm talking about. There's uh, the most recent one from him. That's where they came from. So, <clears throat> I know nothing about Drops Cigar Club, but apparently that is like an online merchant. So, they made their own cigar. <clears throat> so, let's take a look at this cigar. This cigar is... 5x50, it's a Robusto. Uh, the wrapper is Ecuadorian Habano 2000, so a hybrid. Uh, filler is Nicaraguan. Binder is Ecuadorian, okay? And that's what we have here. And basically, you get like a, almost like a Tiffany-looking theme going on here. I mean, yeah, if they want to call it Royal Palm, they can. All right, so it's time to smoke it, light it up, and... We'll see how that goes. I mean, I'll actually, before we go anywhere, let's start with the price. <clears throat> Box of 10 is $110, which makes each one $11, okay? My throat is so dry today. Don't even know what's going on, but <clears throat> nothing cannot be solved with some water. I meant the water is cold. Uh, <clears throat> all right. What happened when you review a lot and the weather is not helping? Mm. There isn't much smell to it. Just like... Maybe a little bit of leatheriness, and that's pretty much it. <clears throat> I don't know. Smells like guy. Hey, that smells like leather. <clears throat> Tastes like leather. This a cross between some. Cashew nuts. And gingerbread cookies. <clears throat> All right. Plap, plap. Let's light it up. $11. Let's see. Let's see what you got. <clears throat> Dry is good. Smoke output is not bad. Right away, peppery. Peppery, leathery. Um, 
There's some bitterness to it. What? <clears throat> Smells like licorice. Tastes kind of leathery and peppery. Powder. Spicy. Um, that's pretty much it. Tastes nothing like a royal palm or palm tree or green. Yeah, I got nothing. Just that. Which is very peppery. Well, let me smoke one third. I'll be right back. So we're at one third. The flavor is um, a little bit sweeter. Maybe a little bit chocolate. And it's just mostly pepper. I taste mostly pepper. It still burns a lot. The uh, strength about medium. But it's not much going on. Like, I can't say there's a lot going on. I can't say there's nothing either, but it's mostly pepper. Mostly pepper. <clears throat> you taste anything, the pepper just wipes it out. So, I don't know. It's mediocre at best right now. So, we'll see if the second there brings more flavor because there's no flavor. So, I'm hoping, I'm, I'm talking to the boys right now. Hope, hopefully, this brings me some surprises in between. You know, you want to trust $11. Aside from being at like a <clears throat> store exclusive, you should have a good reason, right? So, we'll see if that gives a good reason. Be right back. Pepper. Maybe some nut. Mixed nuts, no kind of thing. But mostly pepper. Mostly pepper. If you like white pepper, this is it. White pepper. So <clears throat> I think I can safely say this is between $6 or $8. $8 being because it's like a store exclusive kind of thing. It's kind of catchy. It's kind of weird. But... This is between six dollars or eight dollars a cigar, not a eleven dollars a cigar, and I'm like eight dollars, like at best. It's that rare. It, only they have it. You gotta try something. One stick, eight dollar. So, last turn now. So let's finish it up. <clears throat> you know why we finish it up? Let's 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 check out this band. So all they got. It's a drop CC, which is the cigar club, drop cigar club, and it's just royal palm. That's it. And then a palm tree. That's it. That's all I got. Very small pen. Very, very small pen. <clears throat> so being a Robusto, give me an hour of smoke. But like it's so boring of a cigar. You know, I, I don't see anything special, particular about the cigar. It's just boring. The, the sweetness is so minor, too. It's like not really there. The pepper will just kill everything. So, I don't know. I'm going to finish up the last stir and then we'll go to summary. All right. Last stir. As usual, like any other cigar, drop off in flavor. Just blend. <laughs> I'm just going to keep coughing. Yeah, just a little bit of like... Nut and pepper. There's not much to it. There's there's really not much to talk about this cigar. <clears throat> I think it's just one of those like store exclusive. They took a you know bundle and banned it. One of those cigars. So yeah, six to eight dollar smokable cigar. Not much transition. Not much flavor. A little bit of pepper. A little bit of leatheriness. A little bit of um, uh, 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 nuts, and that's it. That's it. <clears throat> there, there is um, there is barely anything, right? So cashews, cashew nuts, pepper, a little bit of sweetness, maybe licorice, 
That's it. That's all you're gonna get. All right. <clears throat> so now 11, eight at best, uh, because story exclusive kind of thing, and that's pretty much it. You, you can't get much out of it. So, but nevertheless, thanks to uh, Rogers, uh, uh, Working Man Cigar for sending me this cigar so I get to try it. Thank you. Uh, make sure to go check out Walking Man Cigars uh, uh, cigar channel as well. Um, yeah, the best unboxing videos. <laughs> All right, so that will be it for this review. I will see you guys next time. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment, share. Uh, make sure to check out our podcast on Sundays. And uh, also check out members only sections. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.